In electric circuits, we have two types of elements, passive and active. Let's understand the difference between them in one minute. Passive elements are not capable of generating energy. These include resistors, capacitors, and inductors. Those either dissipate energy, as in the case of the resistor, or store it, as in the case of the capacitor and inductor. No batteries, no amplifiers, just managing energy that's already there. Active elements, on the other hand, are capable of generating energy. The most important examples are voltage and current sources, whether independent or dependent. These ideal sources do a good job at approximating practical generators and batteries, for example. These generally deliver power to the circuit connected to them. But it doesn't stop here. Active elements also include transistors. These are considered active because they can amplify electrical signals and control the flow of current, requiring an external source to operate. Therefore, operational amplifiers, or op-amps, are also active. So, in short, a passive element doesn't introduce any power gain it just stores or uses energy. An active element needs power and can control or boost signals.